Okay, welcome to um, Vegas HD Productions VFX Time Tutorial with Anton Abilody or Adi Tanto, yeah, the owner of the Vegas HD Productions. So today and in this episode, we want gonna make some effects in Sony Vegas first. We we move to After Effects, G CS. I don't know. I forgot the version. So. Let's make a um, blood hit test using After Effects. So, um, first step, you have to had a uh, you had to have um, some footage. I just this footage. You can see it first. Yeah, that's it. This is empty footage. If if I played with the real time, action, it will be like. Action. Yeah, like that. Okay, so um, what you're gonna need is oh yeah, I forgot. I'm using um, Action Essentials 2 for the blood and etc. But I will give it to you free, uh, which is I'm using in here. It's blood burst tent, blood hit six, and then powder hits, and yeah, only that. So you can make any videos you would make or something I don't know what the tense because I don't really um, know about English so let's get started first we get the, um, the blood what blood burst first yeah okay um, we move to here the blood burst you can see there is a blood yeah it's there is a blood here so um, just move when he gets shot. The position he gets shot. Um, and yeah, right above this. So it will be um, overlap. This is just minimize it or whatever. If if you know more about action essentials, eh, sorry, I mean. After Effects, <laughs> you can um, combine yourself with your own techniques. So here is the footage. So I minimize it until the place he got shot. Uh, uh, wait, wait a minute. I want to know when where he got shot. Okay, the center one. So here. Not exactly in here, but in here. The camera is not moving, so it's okay to put it into like this. But if the camera is moving, you should use um, some uh, tracker, yeah, track motion, if you want to make it good. So one more time, like that. Okay, that's good. But in Freddy W's videos they use some smokes to make the blood more real so I have a powder hits in here powder hits I don't know I have to make it shorter first okay, like this yeah and put it into the blood splatter but behind it not in front of it so it would be like this then what you're gonna do is search the effects um, tint to, to change the color of the powder so drag it to the powder here powder and then map white into the red one who look like which look like a blood like this okay so it's more like blood after that just play it okay that's if you if if we see at the ending it still have any blood it's okay because the footage in just until this frame but if it's um, any continuous movement after that you have to make a feeder of it which is just press um, just just I don't know the hotkeys so just open up um, so, ah, collapse there 
collapse the powder and then transform and make um, opacity make a key in here and then in the first two and then um, one or two frame be before it's gone so make it here and back to the last keyframe make it zero so yeah it's it's like gun but that's that's what you should do if you got um, uh, no ended footage not like this if if like this we don't need the key so just 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 we don't need the key so make your opacity to hundred to a to a hundred and yeah like this that's 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 it so um it's look like real but the more realistic if we had if if him get a blood hit in on it so I got a blood hit just make um, the blood and powder disappeared and drag the blood hit it's gonna be a long footage so a eh, long effects or video so I have to make it shorter first oh yeah I will upload the the footage not in the end of this video but on uh, my own playlist it's called footage I will um, put the link below like this eh? um, yeah like this it's just too big wait I have to see where the power is or the blood ah oh, yeah on it in here not too big not too small yeah and then make it like um, 3d so so I think it will be move I don't know how to make it oh, okay I know just uh, just make a um, new frame key frame um, now just a new S null object it's in form of the bloodhead uh, um, it's okay that it's okay but um, that would be better okay track motion no not the footage I mean just just the footage and then track motion see the motion source is the footage then a current tracker tracker one just just the point when he got the shot I don't know just anywhere or in anywhere huh let's put the, the contrast one it's gonna be um more harder than before uh, I think we should put it in here just yeah um, and then a blood burst it's gonna be apply motion to the null and then we are um scale and rotation wait let me see the footage first It's, it's like kind of you can see in here before the clothes it's it's this part of his clothes and uh, so I think I forgot ah dang it ah, okay I found it so just put it in hmm, something like here or like in here 
so when we analyze it It's not in here, it's exactly in here. Just just change if it's had a false place. Yeah. Put it realistic in there. then yeah I think that's enough so um, apply or options the minions and then apply X and Y to the null object I don't know if I could put it or no just to try it a blood head it's it's in there and then we make it into the no object it moving but not exactly in the place just change it or maybe uh, when he close the chest just just make the opacity of the bloodhead um, zero so make a key and then yeah in when he open it or one frame before it closed or in here yeah and then make it uh, okay one frame before it so when he close his chest just make the opposite to zero so you see like this okay I, w I will try to um, render it action action Action. It's kinda weird though because there is no blood, just the blood hit and it's look like um something funny but if we um combine it with a powder and a blood burst it gonna be like Action duh, like Action that. So it will be like a realistic things and uh, that's it from the VFX time tutorial about blood hit. So thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe at to favorites and then um, to Twitter at Vegas HD Pro and don't forget to subscribe. Oh, I said it twice. And don't forget to like and click the ads if you want to to make uh, to donate to us. So thank you for watching, guys, and hope to see you soon.